Welcome to So Like a Pro Time. Monica. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to So Like a Pro Time. I'm Teresa Sigmund, and you are in the right place to learn to choose, alter, and make the dance sport, country, and skate dress of your dreams. I have with me today Monica, and she is wearing a Brad Griffey's dress, which looks stunning on the floor. So we are at the 2019 Adult National Figure Skating Championships in Salt Lake City, and you skated earlier today. Um, how did you do? How did you like your performance? Um, I skated uh, Masters Junior Senior Group 2 okay. category, and I came in second. Um, I skated well. I'm proud of myself. This is my first competition back in 20 years, so this is an, a great experience. Um, and I had a great skate, and I'm so glad that I came in second. Nice. Very good. Yeah, because you had skated for like 20 years and then took a 20-year break. That's a long break. Yes. So this dress, I'm going to step out and just have you do a slow rotation all the way around, please, ma'am. Just because this is a really high impact dress. It's got some fabulous rhinestoning lines on it. It is a black mesh over purple mesh. And which brings me to one of the things that I really like about this dress in addition to the stoning, but I'm going to start with the underwear. When you do not have underwear that match your underskirt, it really sticks out like a sore thumb, especially in skating when you're going at such high speeds and your tush shows a whole lot and when the skirts are already micro short. So what Brad Griffey's did on this dress, which is particularly awesome, is oops, <laughs> under or the underskirt and the trunks are the same color. Ladies, you have to do this. If you make your own dresses, you must do this. If you buy a dress, consider not buying it if these do not match or if um, or have somebody alter it. Because if I get this out of the way, and if we look at it, I'm gonna have you hold black. Yes. There we go. So if you had, actually, we're gonna go ahead and let the black go. I'm gonna hold okay. purple. So if you had per a black skirt and purple underwear, Look how obnoxious this is, because then your underwear really stand out. Whereas if I have purple skirt and purple underwear, then everything's really cohesive. I don't know if that was the best example or not, but this is a fabulous feature. The other thing I like about this dress, so long as we're talking about skirt, we've got a slit over here. It overlaps about two inches, maybe five centimeters. I think this is a fun feature. It gives, allows more skirt movement without necessarily having a lot of skirt volume. And then on this side, this little handkerchief is super fun and it's really just where the, um, the circle of the skirt goes out and instead of cutting it in a circle, they just cut it in a jagged line so it creates what's basically little handkerchiefs. I think this is an awesome detail, very easy to do, but you do have to plan in advance and with something like this, if you do it and you hate it, you just cut it off. <laughs> it's really <laughs> awesome. Monica, what is your favorite thing about this dress? Oh, the color. Yeah. And just the stonework on it is absolutely amazing. Um, I told him, I gave him my music. He absolutely loved it. And I said, I just want something dark. I want you to be creative and mm -hmm. go with it. And what's so amazing is that it ended up with black and purple, which are my favorite colors. So it oh, couldn't wow. have been more perfect for my senior dress. I think it, he did a, a fabulous job on it. Nice, nice. Yeah, it's got some really great detailing. Heliotrope is one of my favorite rhinestones. And so there's a ton of all of these up in here are mostly heliotrope and heliotropes are cool because they look a little grayish or red violet depending on how you're looking at them. And then these tiny little baguettes on here are a spectacular touch. I've actually never seen these in person. They're gorgeous. Love those. There's a really wide border, probably two inch and a half, four to five centimeters wide. It's fabulous. Um, the sleeves fit pretty darn well. You had this custom made yes. mm -hmm. and, and it shows because this one fits despite the fact that you are lacking bust darts or a princess dart which would help form the busts. Yes. It still fits really well compared to a lot of the dresses that I've seen today because it was actually made for you and it really does make a difference. So the armpit, 
So Brad did a fabulous job up here. This is what I teach in my sewing school to do a beautiful mesh job with no seam going over the shoulders. It keeps this fitting gorgeous. This fits beautifully in the armpit. Thank you, Brad Griffiths, for this because this is fabulous. This is the way it should be done, ladies. This is what I teach you in my school. This is fantastic. And if we turn sideways here, um, this sort of bunching back here is classic with skate skirts. Um, full back zippers, you'll notice this. Those of you in my sewing school who are gonna watch this video going, oh yeah, I know why this did this and you know how to fix it because I teach you how to fix it. Full back zippers are tough because there are so many curves in the spine. It really is. And then it's, it's totally possible, but it is difficult. And then once it's rhinestoned, it helps camouflage the zipper so that the zipper ends up looking like these other areas. So that's pretty fun. I'll turn around so that they can see that. So yeah, I think this is a spectacular dress. I actually asked Monica if she was a gymnast because this particular design emphasizes your broad shoulders and narrow hips because all of this, we've got the triangular stoning that goes out here and because she's completely covered on the shoulders and the neck, it really, um, emphasizes your natural shape, which depending on your routine and your comfort level is either good or bad. But I think this is gorgeous and I really appreciate you modeling here. This is definitely one of the better dresses I've seen for sure this weekend as far as quality and just overall fit and having good detailing. So yeah, like the skirt. Um, do you have anything you want to tell me about the dress? Oh. Uh does it cover your tush well or does oh, it yes, up? Oh yes, yes. It actually fits my rear very nicely Good. and I kind of have a nice round rear and that's a big problem that I have with a lot of skating dresses that when I move it tends to slide to the crack and then ladies, you know, you don't want to skate around with a thong no. look. Um, <laughs> it's very unflattering. <laughs> so I, I really appreciate the fact that he understood that uh -huh. I, I wanted all of that covered yes. and it's it sticks very well. Good. I, I appreciate good, that. Yeah, good, good. <laughs> All right, then Monica and I are going to sign off then. If you have enjoyed today's video, please share it with all of your dancing, skating, sewing friends. Go to sewlikeapro.com, leave me your name and email address. I'll sign you up for the newsletter and make sure that you also know when my sewing school is open for enrollment. Leave a comment about this awesome dress. What's your favorite aspect? The skirt, the trunks, the rhinestoning lines. It's got a lot of great design elements going on here and just pure functionality. So I think that is it. Thank you so much for joining Thank me today, Monica. Thank you for Monica. having me. And everyone, please follow. I watch her on YouTube. Um, I've been wanting to learn how to make my own dresses. I stone and decorate. And I found her on YouTube. And I've been following her ever since. And I'm going to join the school because I want to learn how to create something this amazing. So thank you so much for having me. Aww. And thank you for your video and your school. Oh, you all. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm going to cry. We're going to end now. We're I will going to get emotional. Right. I will talk to you all later. <laughs> Bye. You. Bye. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. <laughs> and I'll be talking to you and watching you soon. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Great. Thank you. Yep. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> thank you.